everybody, World War 627 here, and welcome to another Minecraft video. But this is not just another Minecraft video, guys. We're starting a new series today, so this should be fairly exciting. Um, the whole reason we're starting a new survival series, and I still don't know what I'm going to call it yet, as a series on YouTube, since I already have survival from scratch, this is kind of like the name I came up with. But we'll figure it out, so... The basic plan is to, I don't know why these people keep calling me, I'm going to shut my phone off right now, okay, or at least put it on airplane mode. So with that being said, let's get started. World name, we're just going to leave a new world for now, survival, we're not doing creative. Creative is for when we want to let the creative juices flow, we're going to let that sit right there, we're going to try and get start from the bottom and work our way up we're gonna leave the seed blank i don't know what we're gonna do uh my friend king kerm suggested that we look up a seed however i just feel like it's better if we start off he's not joining me in this video i was supposed to get a hold of him however i don't know what he's doing hopefully he will join us next week this will become the main Minecraft series. We're looking at an episode a week here. This will be a normal thing on the channel. I don't know about the other ones, just, you know, with the new biomes, it made sense to start a new one. We were kind of like at a standstill. We weren't getting ender pearls on the, on the other thing, so we're just gonna stay right here. Okay, so, bonus chest. Uh, we might get melon seeds. That's the only reason we really would need it, and I tend never to get melon seeds, so maybe we'll get those. Um, I do not want autosave in, so in case something goes terribly wrong, meaning like it, cr um, if somebody trolls the world, I'm not saying, I'm not gonna do this in case, you know, I like die or something, I'm gonna be a dick and I'm gonna just not save it. In case somebody trolls the world, in case somebody somehow gets in here. I never want that. So therefore, we'll do tr we'll do trust players, obviously. Um disable auto save. Customize super flat that has nothing to do with it. Game game options. Invite only. Okay, no host privileges. We want achievements even though I'm only missing 5 of them. Okay, so that looks like that's just about it. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's get going. So, I'm really looking forward to some new beginnings with this new world. Should be fairly exciting. This is basically just going to be like a setting up video. We're going to try and find a village. Or if we can find the one, we'll make another area. I've noticed since this new update came out that there seems to be less villages spawning for some reason. They just... And what do you freaking know as soon as I say that? Welcome to the new world. Here's a village right here. You know what? When you... I know a lot of people love when there's villages right at spawn. So, I will definitely put the seed in the description. Wow, how about this? This just freaking trounced what I said. Look, there's even a cave entrance here, guys. We just got a freaking awesome spawn. Look, we got a plains biome right here. That's always good. We're right along the water. We got a desert village. This is just fucking sweet. Guys. Guys. Look, and we got sheep, too. Let's... Here's my bed for the night. We gotta go find the bonus chest in case we get melon seeds. But we need a bed. We got wood over here. We got some birch. We got some oak. We got some acadia. We got everything over here. This is an awesome freaking spawn. Alright, so now I will definitely leave the seed in the description. And when I log out, I'll just put it on screen, too. In case I f forget that, I will put in the description anyway. Look, we got some new flowers right here. What are these? And is there a bluette? Kind of like two names for blue in the same name. 
But nevertheless, is that the bonus chest? What is that? No, that's a sheep. Oh no, those are cows. Jesus Christ. Can't see anything. Okay, where is the bonus chest? Wait, we spawned like right here, didn't we? Guys, why am I not looking at the bo Why can't I find this fucking bonus chest? Did I, I put it on, right? If I rewatched this video and I saw I didn't put it on, then I'd be like a freaking idiot. But we really don't need a bonus chest, guys, aside from if we got... Oh, wait, I think that's it right there. Is that it? Yep, here we go. All right, I was about to say. We did not get melon seeds, but we got a good array of tools. That is going to help out a lot. I don't feel that bad that I took the bonus chest because the supplies I got are kind of right here anyway. So, I don't feel that bad. Normally, I feel bad, like, if it's something so good and... Like, oh, yeah, but not bad. Well, we got some raw mutton from the uh, sheep. That's good, too. All right, so we have a place to set up shop. I will definitely leave this seed in the description. I mean, this is just amazing, amazing freaking spawn. So we got a librarian. Do we have a church here? I don't think we do. No, because the priest generally gives really good stuff. Alright, well, let's focus on some other things, guys. Like these carrots right here. We're gonna take all of some of these. Ooh, sorry, villager. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's see if I can make that up to you. Ooh, look at all this. I get some emeralds right now. This guy. Wait, what's your name? You don't have a name. Look at all these trades. These trades are amazing. Look at that. Those are so simple. And all of what you need is right here. Look, we got the carrots. We got the trees. Let's see if we can replant some of those right now. Keep the chain going. Now, <coughs> excuse me there, guys. Obviously, we're going to get to build our own place. Eventually. Because we need to, otherwise we look like dicks. And it's just the right thing to do. There's a skeleton. Somewhere. Don't know exactly where. We'll figure that out. So let's take some of these too. We got more potatoes over here. And we got more cut. So this is really... This is a really good start right here, guys. Once again, the seed will be in the description below. And I will try and get it to you right after this first episode of the new series so it should be pretty damn awesome that way you guys can play on this if you love an awesome spawn this is pretty much it i mean you're not gonna get an end portal at spawn look at this more stuff we we'll just replant some more of this we'll just keep it going look we already have 11 potato profit right here we have a Seven carat profit. Look at, look at these things. We're almost done. This is, this is just awesome. This is a dream. Right here. We already got some great food. We'll go get some nice... Look, we got 21 potato profit from that. Look, there's more stuff over here too. But, you know, we can't just farm the whole day. We gotta get inside. Let's... This is actually kind of neat right here. Actually, I need some food so I can jump high. This'll be good. That way monsters don't get in. I could jump in here. But yet... Wow, that'll work out well. Alright. Well, let's try and get down here. We'll get some stone right away. Now, the th one of the things I always do when I start up... The new world is I immediately start a mine right away <laughs> 
Sorry, King. We're gonna have to get you later. I just don't want him getting in the stream in the uh, episode, guys. That's all. He will be joining me next week. But we gotta get, we gotta focus on what we need right now, and that is some stone. We need to make a furnace right now. And we'll just try and get through the first night and, or at least set up, you know, just the basic start up point. I might do things away from the camera like I, or away from the Elgato, I should say, like I did in the last series. I don't know if I'm going to do that. I probably will because I, with my schedule and just everything, I don't have the opportunity to make... You know, like, multiple videos a day, or even, you know, just more than three videos a week because of my schedule. It's just absolute shit. I would just rather do this all week, to be honest, because I love making videos. I love interacting with you guys, but it's just not possible with the uh, life I live. So, that's unfortunate. But anyway... You know, we're gonna have to deal with it, and, uh, ooh, let's actually look on the map, see exactly where we are. We're gonna put some of the sheep food in. I'll tell you what, we can actually make some charcoal right now. Make some Acadia planks. Because we got plenty of Acadia wood around. Put this in. That'll make some charcoal. Now, if I believe if you do this, you actually get renewable energy. So that's pretty cool. The trophy, renewable energy, if you're just starting out. I got that a long time ago. But either way, guys, we are starting at a good base. And let's try and get some more uh, cobblestone, actually. I know it's a boring block. Nobody get, gives a shit about it. But, you know, we're just starting out, so we're going to need it. Uh, I'll tell you what, the next episode, I'm definitely... Based on the way the initial spawn point looks, I'm definitely going to consider exploring a little bit. Try and find a good place to set up shop. Um, based on the look from here, I mean, I wouldn't consider moving too far. I mean, I love staying in a plains biome. I'd love to find a place, like, right along the river that we can, like, make bridges and stuff. Almost like what we did last time. Oh, look, we got some iron right here. Look at that. That is great. Got some nice iron right here. Look, we got more. And we still got like a third of the health, a uh, third of the uh, go on the pickaxe. Put all this iron right here. Man, I could not have asked for a better start. Even more right here. Even more right here. Just keep the chain going, guys. More iron, more iron. That's awesome. 12 blocks? No way, I thought it was eight, the max in a iron deposit, or any deposit for that matter, except for coal. Coal's always big, but iron, really? Twelve blocks? That's something else. You don't see that in Minecraft a lot. Usually with iron, you just see two. But well, we got fortunate right here. I would like to find some coal. Oh, look what we got here. This is a new block. I haven't played this update that much. Alright, so we got some diorite. Got some diorite right here. I'm not exactly sure what this is used for. If it's just used for building. Because I am I just never really played on PC. So I don't know that stuff for sure. Look, this is a pretty big deposit right here too. Looks like it's some kind of like igneous rock. Like it was formed by a volcano or something. Or, like, dried out lava. That's what it looks like. I knew the block existed. I just don't know the nature of it. Like, if it's used for any special purpose or anything of that matter. But I will find out eventually. Just, like, for the longest time, I didn't know that you... When you actually got out of bed, you didn't have to tap it again. That was one of the, like, King, 
Tin Kerm, so you just saw me kick from the party, actually told me that after a long time, like, you don't have to tap the bed again when you get up if it's raining to stop it from raining. And speaking of some beds, we're gonna make one. So we're gonna get a nice good night's sleep. Right here, we're gonna place the bed. What the hell is that? That's the weirdest bed scene I've ever seen. The worst, the weirdest scene I've ever seen. That's something else. Like I was turned sideways. What happened there? Alright, so we got three charcoal as we thought we would. So, now, I gotta make a tough choice here, guys. Do we smelt the iron? I'll tell you why. Can you smell diorite? No, you cannot. Now, now for those of you who've played Minecraft on PC, obviously this update just came out last month. I have not really gotten the chance to play since the holidays and stuff. Today is January 4th, so we're... Oh, Four days into the new year, so let's just smelt some iron. We'll get some tools out of that. We got some sticks right here. Now, it's going to take two of our charcoal since it takes eight. You could smelt eight blocks with one charcoal. So we'll let that go. And then we'll sm uh, cook these uh, the mutton from the sheep. And after that, to be honest, guys, I think we're just going to call it a quick video there. I uh, just want to get basic setup going. Uh, next week, uh, probably exploration, looking for the place for the house. But we needed a good foundation. We needed to start off. And we basically got that done right here. Sorry, Johnny. There we go. Okay. No way, guys. I, I'm, I'm seeing... I'm seeing that. Don't think I'm not seeing that. We're going. We're going right after this. We cannot end this video without going in there. Right over in there, over on top of that little sand hill right over there. We need to make a quick pit stop over there, guys, because if you do not know what that is, that's been in this game for a while. So if you know Minecraft, you should know what that is. That is a freaking desert temple. So we are going to be going over there right after this. I'll tell you what. We'll stop you. We'll stop you. Let's get some... Oh, shit. I just hit the microphone. Alright, so let's get some sheep food going. We got some sheep food. Alright, so that's what the cook version looks like. Of the uh, mutton or food you get from sheep. Oh, sheep. Not exactly sure how many health bars it gives you. A uh, steak obviously gives you four. Health bars cook the steak. So we will see how much health it in fact does give you. We got four bars right now. And we're just going to let this one finish up. Then we're going to go see the desert temple. Look, we got enough sand to get out of there too. So we got some experience for that. And we get three bars. So that's not that bad. Three boys are out for that. So let's go take a trip over to the desert temple. Now hopefully I don't blow it up. To be honest, I might just take the safe way down there. Actually, I don't have torches. That would have been a smart thing to do. But we're not smart, so we don't go in there with torches. Look, we got like an island over there too. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice spawn area right here. You got a freaking desert temple. Nice village. All good. Look, we got 
Is that purple? It doesn't even look like blue. Maybe it's my screen, because my screen, the brightness with the Elgato just sucks. And I want to fall over there, so I'll tell you what. We're going to do this the safe way. And I never do this the safe way. But we're going to do it the safe way, because I'm actually going to be smart this time. So we're going to go out here. We're going to look for a quick supply of some wood. That looks to be over here to make a quick crafting table. That's someplace close, so you know what? Just forget it. We don't need that. Or do we? No, we don't. Oh, wait. Yeah, we do. Fuck. Damn it. Alright. Because I want to make a freaking another pickaxe to get down there the safe way, so we are going to do it the safe way. So we'll chop some quick, a uh, little bit of Katie down here. I'll make crafting table. Nice old crafting table. And we'll make a nice stone pickaxe. Another stone pickaxe. And now we will be able to do this the safe way and just scale down the side. Instead of trying to make the jump and trying to get over because I failed with that miserably and sometimes off the Elgato so I do not want to mess with that this time so we're just gonna see right here go in this way right. I just want to make sure okay there's nothing down there it's gonna mess with us goodbye pressure plate And we are going to destroy the TNT. That would make sure nothing unforeseen happens. I think it's all cleared out. Alright. So now let's get the fudge up here. Oh yes, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, we have found five diamonds. Seven diamonds. Now, I don't think it's the same for every desert temple, but if it is, and you use this seed, you are going to get off the one freaking hell of a start. Now, I do not see a stat, uh, saddle, and that very much upsets me, but I tell you what, this ain't that bad. <laughs> this is freaking awesome. So let's go grab these. We'll use the stone axe instead, and then once we're done with that, guys, we're going to get the hell out of here, because it's been so good of a start, I don't want anything to mess this shit up. So, what are we not going to use? We're going to need sand for windows for the new house. So, I kind of want to save as much as possible. So, let's get up with the cobblestone right here. So, we are going to get up and get the hell out. Ah, who cares? Did we get that wall? Yeah. Oh, that's clay. That's freaking clay. Oh, it's not wool anymore. Now it's clay. How about that? It used to be wool. This is when you don't play with the new update for a while, guys. Is this clay too? Yep. Makes that nice hard sound. Just like the blocks. Alright, so we're going to go eat some more mutton. We're going to be munching on some mutton. And we're going to head back... That way, in case when I spawn in here next time and leave my game sitting for a little bit, I don't get attacked by monsters. Or mobs, whatever. Yeah, let's, let's kill a couple of cows. With the next best thing from a sword, which is a pickaxe. So we'll ignore that crafting table that we left there. We really don't care. But guys, what a freaking start. This is the best start I've ever seen. At least from my perspective. This is just freaking awesome. I'm going to give you guys the seed right now. going to get off of here. Come on, get up there. Alright. 
So we're just gonna leave it in here. We're gonna exit and save. Because that is just freaking awesome. Okay. So now the seed of this awesome spawn point is and this will be in the description as well. Six eight five seven six three eight two three eight seven two two oh four eight three three six. Okay. So that is the miraculous spawn point seed. Maybe you'll get something worse in the desert temple over there. Maybe you'll get something even better than what I got. I got seven diamonds, some iron, and some gold, so that was pretty good. Some bones as well. So we'll try and get to taming some uh, dogs or wolves next episode, too. So we are going to name this... Hmm, what should we name the new save world? We will name it Awesome Start. I think Awesome Start would make sense. Actually, I gotta put the date because I always do that. Makes it easier for me to reference what world it is. So today is one four. Boom. So guys, thank you very much for watching this awesome start of an awesome new world. It's going to be starting up on my YouTube channel. This will be the main Minecraft Monday series. I don't know what else is going to be there. I showed you guys my horse track over here. I'm probably not going to do much else on that. Uh, the creative world, I might just add some stuff. I'll give you update tours on that, you know, every every three months or whatever. Because that's not really a work in progress, but this will be an absolute work in progress, guys. So, thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, do what you did again. Like the video down below and subscribe for more content every Monday. Mon Monday, okay? Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, guys. Thank you so much for watching and for supporting my channel. Should be an awesome series, guys. I'm going to catch you Wednesday for some awesome... Hmm, what should we do Wednesday? I got some new games right here. And my clock is still messed up. My clock is still messed up. I don't know why my clock is still messed up. So here are some games I have now. I'm going to pull these up right here. We got Halo installing right now. We got Black Ops 3, NBA. Not really interested in that. This is what we're going to be bringing you. On Wednesday, Star Wars Battlefront. I finally got that. Halo Reach also backwards compatible. I might do some stuff on that. I'm probably going to delete this. Stay the K. I really just play for fun. We're going to be doing men. We're going to be probably doing Fallout. We're going to do some Battlefront. And we're definitely going to do some Halo along with Black Ops 3. So guys, there's going to be a lot of stuff. A lot of exciting stuff coming up. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you on Wednesday with some Star Wars Battlefront. Peace guys.